so much just because we've been trying for this since our freshman year and now we've just grown as a team so it's just so nice knowing that we could go to state now. Yeah. What, what were your overall thoughts on, on how the team played tonight in this win? I think uh, really what got it was our defense because so many steals and that helped our um, offense because we got a lot of uh, after we stole it, we got a lot of offensive transition points. So that's where a lot of mine came from uh, after we had to steal. So. Yeah. You talk about that mindset. I, I think, you know, you can kind of anticipate when, when maybe TJ or McKenna is getting a steal. It seemed like you were able to, to take off and, and go the other way. Is that something you kind of look for is to see if you can get behind the defense and, and get some easy buckets? Yeah, that's kind of what I look for just because I've played with them for so long. I know when one of them's going to get the rebound, when one of them's going to come up the court. So I, we just know each other so well that I can just do that. Yeah. This is a program, uh, Linux Girls Basketball, that has come a long way in the last four years. Uh, what, what's it mean for, for you and the other three seniors to you know, have 20 wins under your belt and you're, you're one game away from the state tournament? What's, what's that mean for you guys? Uh, I don't even know a word. I'm way too pumped up for this, but it means so much. And I'm just, I'm just ready to go to finals and win that to go to state. Yeah. What, what's it going to take to do that and go to state? Uh, we usually go over our scouting the week after, so we'll find out next week. But any, everything we got, we're going to put it all out Wednesday night. It really means a lot, especially because like our freshman year, you know, just making it past first round was the, like a really big thing for us. And now we're planning to go to state, so it's really exciting, and uh, we're on a mission. Yeah. Uh, the defense tonight was was what won it for you guys. I think you've had 20 steals as a, as a team tonight. What was what was working for you in that that your pressure and, and even in the half court? How were you able to generate so uh, so much defense? Uh, we knew that we were going to have to pressure a lot. We knew that our press our press has been pretty successful all year, and we knew we had to keep that up. And we had certain things we were supposed to stop on defense, and I think we did a really or on half court defense, and I think we did a good job of that. Yeah. What, what about uh, that, that defense leading to some offense for you? You, you struggled a little bit in the half-court offense tonight. What's, what's, uh, what's it mean to be able to get out and transition and help you on that offensive end, too? Uh, it's, a, it's, it's definitely a confidence booster. Whenever, if we're struggling on half-court defense, that we can get those steals, get those rebounds, and just run. You're going to a regional final. You play Xyra Elkhorn Kimbleton next week. What's it, what's it going to take to get a win and go to state? Uh, I guess we're just taking one step at a time. We'll figure out what we need to do in practice, but I think we all need to play hard and uh, just keep up the confidence. We, we know it, it's possible. We can do it, but we just got to put in the work. Uh, outstanding defense. That's probably the name of the game for us right now. Uh, and that defense not only did it hold them down and uh, what they were able to do, uh, gave us a lot of transition buckets. And I'm going to say that's probably where the, the game was won. Uh, what, what was working for you on defense? I mean, you guys just seemed like you were you were all over. You had hands on on the basketball all night. What what was working on that end of the floor? It's just they want to get up and play hard and create ball pressure. You know, TJ and, and uh, Cassidy Nelson especially, they just have God given talent where they can read passes and uh, they know how to play possum a little bit and wait for them to make a bad pass and then uh, you know that just carries on to the other girls and. Uh, you know, they kind of taught them how to do it, and, and it seems to work for us. You mentioned TJ and Cassidy. you got the other two seniors as, as well that are in your starting lineup. How big are those four to kind of be that steadying force for, for you guys, especially as you advance in tournament play? Yeah, you know, they, they've done this for years together since they were little girls. Um, and then, like I said, it just showed because Jordan came up and got that huge steal at the end of the game. You know, we think of her as post player, but she was able to do the same thing. And, uh, you know, they're leading the way. I'm telling you, they're leading the way in practice. They're leading the way on the, on the bus trips, and they're definitely leading the way in celebrating in the locker room right now. What, what's this mean for, for this program overall? I mean, this is a program that has gone from single-digit wins every year to now playing in a, a regional final. What, what does that mean for you guys? Yeah, it's, it's th those four seniors, number one. Uh, it's our strength and conditioning that has gotten a lot better over the course of the year, uh, past two or three years. That's to Michael Nardini. But, you know, these four seniors, uh, we had a really good past volleyball season the past couple years. It has nothing to do with me and Tom Christensen. We don't know much about volleyball. And obviously, we're having success in softball. These four seniors are really leading the way. But the best thing that they're doing is they're teaching the younger girls uh, how, how to get there. And uh, we're seeing it in the young, younger grades, clear down in the junior high. You guys will go to a regional final. You get Xyra Elkhorn Kimbleton. They beat Stanton by 10 tonight. Uh, they're, they're undefeated. What, what's it going to take to get a win and go to state? 
really good defense, and it's going to be even tougher because uh, every girl that steps on the court for them can shoot, and they can shoot from uh, deep range. So uh, we're going to watch a little bit of game film and come up with a game plan and see what happens.